channel organic living with archita how are you everyone hope everybody is doing well i am also well today i am going to share with all of you one vegetarian vegan dish that's called the name of the recipe is eggplant poppy seed gravy so you are thinking it might be a western dish no this is a typical indian dish it doesn't have any western content so stay tuned with me don't go anywhere let's take a look what i am using for this recipe this is some whole spices this is oil of course mustard oil if you put mustard oil it tastes better this is turmeric for color this is white poppy seed the white poppy seed are full of antioxidant you can google about it this is salt as per taste white salt you can use sea salt also this is some green chilies this is optional if you don't want you can skip it this is chopped coriander leaf i will be adding in my cooking and this is one whole coriander leaf for garnishing this is tomato this is asafoetida hing just for taste and this is whole small eggplant that's how i cut it like a flower taking some poppy seed for grinding adding some tomatoes on it some green chili around 4 to 5 because i like spicy that's why i'm adding it if you don't want you can skip it for blending putting some water For making eggplant poppy seed gravy, I have ready everything: the poppy seed paste, salt, turmeric, oil, chopped coriander leaf, some spices. So don't waste time. Let's start the cooking. After five minute of shallow fry, the eggplant became like this. They are not fully cooked, but they are soft. So make sure when you take them out, all the eggplant will be like this. So we have to keep them whole. If they break, the recipe will be messed up. So now I will be going to add little more oil.
Now I am going to put some whole spices in the oil like fennel, fenugreek, mustard, seed like this. I have already put all the spices in the oil and this is the time to add some one this is, this is optional also one green chili and some like pinch of hing yeah just shake it nicely so that all the spices cook nicely I already add my poppy seed paste yes rest of the poppy seed paste I am putting in the cooking pan this is the time I have to wait for 5 to 7 minutes after 5 minutes now I am going to add turmeric because I haven't used it before this is the time I will going to use the turmeric as much as you want like I don't want too much that's why I put very little and also the salt as per taste if you want too salty you can put but I want it mild that's why I put little salt not much At that moment we have to add our fried eggplant sorry shallow fried eggplant yes mix them well nicely so that all the gravy goes inside the eggplant look all the eggplant is whole they didn't break up so we have to keep them like this this is the speciality of this cooking so you have to yeah now we can add some warm water don't put cold water cold water always make them bad you know the cooking lost their taste so always put hot water so now I, I will going to put more water so that all the eggplant cook nicely and all the gravy goes inside now I'm putting the lid off as you can see our recipe is done and all the eggplant are still whole they didn't break up so just try at your home and do let me know in the comment box how it came and how you enjoy the recipe because this is fully vegetarian no onion and no garlic and if you search in the Google, then you can see the poppy seed have lots of benefit. It is antioxidant. So make sure that you are making in the right process. And point to be noted, this recipe you can try with the white rice, the brown rice, and also the chapati. You will be definitely enjoy the recipe. As of now, I am saying goodbye to all of you. I will be meeting with another video very soon till then enjoy be safe and keep watching organic living with archita and don't forget to subscribe like comment and share i will be waiting for your comment okay goodbye thank you for watching